What I've learned is to actually look at art differently, but interestingly enough, I for a while worked on the task force at the Art Gallery of New South Wales as a volunteer. I went to all the Biennales, I looked at a lot of contemporary art, and I looked at the work of Lindy Lee and Pup to One, who um, are not at the Art Gallery of New South Wales, but I was aware of her work. And I didn't know how to actually, I didn't have the language to describe the work, but I also didn't understand what the artist was trying to do with the work, with the contemporary work. I find uh, contemporary art and installations not as accessible as traditional art. So the great thing was, in going to Pup Tuan's uh, studio yesterday and talking to her about her work, it gave you insights into how to actually read contemporary pieces. It opened up another whole world. And then going to Lindy Lee's, I do yoga, I really enjoy yoga, and when she talked about the Buddhist philosophy and how it works with her artwork, her installations, her paintings, again, you're able to sort of reflect on your past experiences and think, it's now, I can now understand, it's now making sense to me, a lot of these contemporary art pieces that I have looked at in Biennale and I've looked at in Museum of Contemporary Art, but I haven't actually understood. So that accessibility to the artist and to be able to have a dialogue with the artist, to go into their home, to ask them questions and to try and get to the depth of their work was absolutely fantastic.